This is the sixth step, or the seventh video, in my video series on how to solve the Rubik's Cube 3x3. In this step, you will be moving the corners around the cube in order to put them in their correct spot. As you can see by my example cube, I have the first two layers corrected, the top cross, and the edges match, and now the corners are in their correct spot. They just don't happen to be turned properly. Yellow, blue, and orange. Sorry about that. Yellow, blue, and orange. So this piece is in its correct spot. It just needs to be turned. Same with this one, this one, and this one. So I will be teaching you one algorithm that is eight steps and easy to remember if you use patterns. So what you want to do is now that you have just finished aligning your edge pieces so that the yellow is on top and they match on the sides, you want to look for a piece, a corner piece, that's in its correct spot. You will usually have one, but in this case I have none, so it doesn't matter how I hold it. If you have one that's already in its correct spot, you hold it in the top left here. And now you perform the following algorithm, which will switch these three corner pieces, keeping everything else the same. R prime U, L U prime, R U, L prime U prime. So now, since that switched these three, if I look around my cube, this piece is now in its correct spot. However, it is turned correctly, which doesn't matter at this point in time. So since I have one that's in its correct spot, I turn the whole cube so it's in the back left, and now I perform that algorithm one more time. R prime U, L U prime, R U L prime, U prime. Now chances are that this will solve your cube, but sometimes it won't, and you'll just need to perform the algorithm one more time. So, in this case, it solved it completely. This corner is in its correct spot, just not turned properly. This one is in its correct spot and turned properly. This one is in its correct spot, but not turned properly. And this one is in its correct spot, but n and turned properly. So, when you perform this algorithm, it'll switch these three and leave the back left one the same. So if you already have one back here, if you already have one solved, be sure to put it back here so you don't move it out of its correct spot. So please click the link in the annotation below, or to your right in the sidebar, or in my movie description, and it will take you to the last video in solving the cube, which is just turning the corners, so now your cube is solved.